Eagles. Welcome to Eagle Eye News. I'm Olivia. And I'm Jonathan. Let's get on with the news. The week we return from spring, spring break, we will have an honor roll breakfast. 6th grade on Tuesday, 7th grade on Wednesday, and 8th grade on Thursday. On Tuesday, Blackhawk hosted the 5th grade open house. Here's a video highlighting some of it. If you see me gone and I'm about to get it started, get it started. I'm gonna show you something that you know. Miss Murray's from Croninger. Unleashed, I'm a beast, got the whole crowd. Party, make a scene, gonna get it out. Real proud, show my teeth. Go wild, go wild, like an animal. <laughs> Your Mighty Eagles soccer teams played Lakeside on Wednesday. The girls' team win were victorious with a 4-1 to one win. Great job, girls. The boys' team also won with a score of 5-1. to one. All of the players on the team contributed to win. Leading the team in goals was Gavin Cuellar with three, Mang Leon and Elijah Yochum each scored one. Anthony Swam held down the middle of the field and provided two assistants. After spring break, the team will be playing on Monday, April 10th against Portage. Now onto the weather. Today there's going to be a low of 43 and a high of 60 degrees. Let's take a look at your spring break forecast. <laughs> now on to the lunch menu. Today we are having galaxy cheese pizza, fiesta beef sandwich, taco flavor hummus, diced peaches, sweet potato fries, salsa, and fresh ve vegetable mix. Last Thursday, Blackhawks academic teams completed in the district competition. Our English team took first place with Haley Curtis, August Dance, and Ruby King. Our science and math teams also placed top three. Great job, Eagles. We have a new segment to introduce called, Which is That Better Grade? In this competition, we ask trivia questions to students of each grade level to see which grade level knows the most. Let's roll that video. What year was World War I in? 1920? What was the original name for World War I? I don't know. The original name for World War One. I. Uh, uh. Okay, and what's 12 times 12? 144. It's an American Revolution. What is 12 times 12? 144. Okay. The original name for World War One. American Revolution. <laughs> what is 12 times 12? 144. What was the original name for World War One? Great War. What is 12 times 12? 144. What is the area of a triangle with the length 6 and height 6? 18. What is the first periodic element? That is hydrogen. What is the area of a triangle with the length of 6 and a height of 6? Um, 18. Okay. okay. What is the first periodic element? Hydrogen. Hydrogen. What is the three things Australia is considered? The kangaroos. The kangaroos. What is an area of a triangle with a base of six and a height of six? Eighteen. Okay. 
Okay. Uh, what is the first periodic element? Uh, hydrogen. And what is the three things Australia is considered? An island, continent, country. What is the what is the area of the triangle of the length of six and height of six? Name two countries that border the United States. Canada, Canada and Mexico. Mexico. Period. Who was the second president of the United States? John Adams. <laughs> Really? Yeah, 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 yeah. What are the three branches of government? Legislative, judicial, judicial, and uh, executive. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Name two countries that border the United States. Canada and Mexico. Okay, who was the second president of the United States? Johnny Adams. Okay, and what are the three branches of government? Legislative, judicial, and executive. And you still vote. Name two countries that border the United States. Canada and Mexico. Who was the third president of the United States? Thomas Jefferson. Okay. And what are the three branches of government? Legislative, judicial, executive. Name two countries that border the United States. Canada, Mexico. What is the second president of the United States? <laughs> Benjamin Franklin. And what are the three branches of government? Legislative, judicial, and executive. <laughs>now it's time for dad jokes i'll go first my therapist told me i have problems expressing my emotions can't say i'm surprised ha 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 <laughs> good one i got one too we're renovating the house and the first floor is going great but the second floor is another story <laughs> oh and uh don't forget that next week is spring break and also don't forget eagles, eagles soar high, high.